Hello, today we're going to go through a quick tutorial on Nielsen Kellerman's new NK Live Link application. Live Link will allow you to live stream your Speedcoach Model 2 with training pack data to the cloud for anyone to view. Now, the first thing we will need is a Speedcoach GPS Model 2 with training pack. It has to have version 2.19 firmware on there. This tutorial will not cover updating the firmware, but you could go to any of our NK Link applications. The firmware is out there, just load up 219 and we can start the live streaming process. Next, we'll need a mobile device. We will need to have cellular or Wi-Fi coverage on this device. Um, for iOS, it needs to be 10.0 or higher. And the device needs to be Bluetooth peripheral capable. So make sure you have a device that is Bluetooth peripheral capable. We will get the app from the Google Play Store or the iTunes Store, depending on which version you have and you'll see it is a new application called NK Live Link. This is going to be different than our NK Link app. The NK Link app still works, it still uploads data. Like I mentioned, you could update the firmware still with the NK Link app, but this is a brand new app that just came out that allows you to stream your data. Now to get started, we have downloaded the app already. The first thing we want to do is go into our settings and make, make sure Bluetooth is turned on which it is. We will then go to open up the NK Live Link app and you'll see it's a nice new app and we have to agree to the terms and services. And now it'll tell you step by step what we need to do here. I'm going to skip through this as this tutorial is going to cover this for you. So let's get started. The first thing that NK Live Link wants to do is make Bluetooth avail uh, devices available. So we'll hit OK. So now that we have the application open, we need to enter a boat ID. Now we want to make this boat ID something where you're going to recognize the name when they're out there. There could be a lot of boats out there. Make it rec recognizable to you. I'm going to call this NK Demo. Click Done. We can see we're not connected to an NK device, so this is where we want to connect to an NK device. And here we have our Model 2. We're going to go to the main menu. And there's a new menu item called Live Stream. This is with the 2.19 firmware, so let's click on Live Stream. Right now it is off. We want to turn it on by clicking there, clicking the down arrow. And now the next item is phone pairing. So we want to do find new phone and click on it and you'll see it's attempting to pair. Now in the app, this line, we hit pair. And within a couple seconds, you should see the two pair with each other and then we'll be set to start live streaming our broadcast. We are now connected to NK Demo and we, so it shows it on here as well. The next item is streaming, so that means the data will be available to get sent to the cloud for any person to view on our app or a web browser. If we click out on the speed coach, we show that it's connected to NK Demo. Hit the button to get rid of that, and you'll see a new icon that shows that we're connected to the cloud. We will start our row the same way by going to ready and we'll need to have the mobile device nearby in the boat. We recommend a waterproof bag to use in, just sit at the bottom of the boat and the two will talk to each other, anyone could view it. If we click on our boat, you'll see it comes up, we can go into the details. Now as we're rowing, these will be populated at a almost real time, every second updated um, refresh rate. It'll show a map of your row. You can click on any of the speed coach measurements, including Orlock data. And even if the rower is not viewing it currently, we can look at our stroke profile again with the Orlock data. And then we could go back. If you have another boat in the area, you can search for it just by scrolling search for location. 
So essentially, this is gonna give you our SpeedCoach XL technology of broadcasting your data, not only just to a coach, but to anyone, but it's to the next level. You can look at any of the stats, any of the time you want. It'll revolutionize the way rowing is viewed. So I hope you enjoy this new feature. Remember, get firmware update 2.19. You will have to update the firmware twice to update the Bluetooth profile, so remember that. And then, away you go.